What a finale! Oh yeah, that was a very interesting finale. Well, before we get any further, let's do this. <clears throat> Hello, everyone, and welcome to the show. Well, yep, coming live to you from the coffee shop that Susie works at. Okay, here we go. <sighs> I'm Tierra. I'm Carrie, and I'm Humphrey. Today is Thor's, everyone. Who are we hitting with Stormbreaker this week? Oh, yeah. We're going to hit everybody who likes... <laughs> who likes what? Everybody who wants Rings of Power and Troll us about it. <laughs> Whoa, Humphrey. Seriously, Humphrey? Do you want to do this? <sighs> yeah. <sighs> so, here it is, folks. She-Hulk has come to an end. Hooray! Finally. Ugh. I've had enough of She-Hulk. <sighs> and because... I've had enough of she hoax. Come on, Loki. It's not about you. It's not about me. It's not about me. <sighs> don't worry. He's always like this. Please, he's been like this since day one, Sophie. Don't be so surprised. Okay, everybody. We have some good news. Now yeah, she hoax is coming to an end. We get to see something new. What? The real ending. Yeah. And who the real bad guy was. <gasps> Ooh. That'll really blow my mind. And they did give us a post credit scene. Yep. And what about season two? <sighs> Unfortunately... Some one person who we thought was the bad guy turned out to be a jerk and he had no intelligence. Aww. Aww, how adorable! Hello, little baby star. I am the star child, Titania. Aww. Okay, okay. We have a lot of things to talk about it. Yeah. So, so this week we could talk She-Hulk. In pop culture. Yeah. But right now, we got something new. Ooh. Wait, aren't we saying we're going to celebrate Shang-Chi? Yes. We're talking Shang-Chi today. Hooray! Hey! What are you doing here? Toys! Sorry, Titania. Today's just not your week. Ugh. Yep. Move aside, Titania. Ah! This is my week. Ugh. Look! What is with you? Sorry, Titania. But today's just not your day. And tomorrow don't look good either. Yeah. Come on. We need Marvel Comet! Bye! Yeah. Okay, Shang-Chi. We need to... Look. So we're going to talk about my show? Yeah, we're going to talk about your show. All right. So, how did it all start? Well, it all began with the promise of one thing. We were looking forward to the Marvel combat. Yeah, that's when Wong and I had a fight in that fight club. <gasps> what? 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 Emil, what are you doing? Oh, hi, Jen. Emil! 
Look, we already dealt with that story in the show. No, Emil. We don't talk about Fight Club. Wait, no Fight Club? Ha! Yeah. Rule number one. No Fight Club. Well, rule number two. Ha! Okay, so rule number one, no talking about Fight Club. Rule number two, no fucking talking about Fight Club. So, uh, so, come on now. We're going to seek a song, aren't we? Yep. <clears throat> ha. Listen here. Uh, yeah. So, what do we do now? We're going to talk about my show. Yeah, we're going to talk about your show. That's right. Let's talk about your show. Yeah. And not only that, we're going to talk about She-Hulk. Yeah. Yeah. That was so embarrassing, Wong. What? You. We were in an underground fight club. Yeah. 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 Huh. <sighs> Look, here's one. We want, we need more. Oh, rumor has it that your movie is going to come back about three years from now. Hooray! Yeah, and then of course, your ten rings, Miss Marvel's bangle, or Infinity Zones. Yep. Hmm. And then we will be hearing from Fen Fang Foom. Who? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, that dragon that I beat up in the cartoons? Yeah, I shrink him. Hey, let me out. Let me out. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, mister. Not until you behave yourself. Oh, man. Wow. Just wow. Okay. Wow. So why are we talking Shang-Chi? Because Emil, Blonsky, and Wong were doing Fight Club. Yeah, my Fight Club. And, uh, it, did you really have to show that shirtless thing? Dude! It's a Marvel movie. <sighs> what is the number one rule of Marvel? Oh no, I know, I know! What, Sprite? Ah. <sighs> Uh, the rule is the male protagonist in the movie has to not have a shirt on because we want to see him in all his glory. Hmm. What about women? A tank top. Ooh, with lipstick. Ah, that's right. Oh, look, Carol is trying to make us all comfortable in our bar. Mm-hmm. I'm going to be, you know, <laughs> making myself comfortable. It's very good, Sprite. Here, get this coconut water. Ah, 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 ah. What? Not until you serve the toys or tea and cookies. Oh, man. <sighs> Yep. Okay, so there it is. So we're talking Shang-Chi, we're talking She-Hulk season finale, and not only that, there's going to be more. Ooh. Yep. Well, I literally break the fourth wall. <laughs> I mean, I broke the fourth wall. You did! Yeah. So what happened? A lot of people liked it though. Of course they liked what they see. They always like what they see. Yep. And we're going to take it to our next subject. I swear it up to me. Say hi to Homelander. Hi, I'm Homelander. Whoa, whoa. Who 
the heck is that? Who is this jerk? It's Homelander. What's a Homelander? Me. <laughs> Am I not wonderful? Oh, God, you're awful. Yeah. How can you be so horrible to those toys? Because the toys don't like me. I mean, come on. Everybody should like me. Homelander. Hmm? No, Homelander. We do not like you. Oh, come on. Even the mini toys don't like me. Ugh. Can't believe it. You guys would prefer a sludge monster over me. <laughs> Listen here, Homelander. You will get no respect. And if you do not, I will tear you apart. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Jeez. Uh, uh, uh. Yep, that happened. Ha. <sighs> whoa, whoa. What on earth is that? It's called Star Child. <sighs> I am the entity that is known as the Star Child. <sighs> okay, everybody. Toys, tea and cookies are ready for you. Thanks. I like this job, Mugger, good doodles. Yeah, I'm relieved to not have to be tied up by the evil versions of the toys. Yeah, evil versions of toys. Ooh, jeez, what happened? Oh, you have to be there, Kate. Yeah, because the the evil versions of my friends showed up out of nowhere and took us hostage. Jeez, what is this? Yep, the quintessential trouble Star Trek. Mirror, mirror. Oh no. Is that the word where Spock has a beard and everybody wears bad clothes? Yep, and Kirk is the least dressed among them. <laughs> I mean, yeah, they just they just didn't even give Kirk any sleeves. I mean, even Uhura was wearing a tank top and a miniskirt. And she was just as much dressed as everybody else. Well, I don't know why they gave Kirk a shirt with no sleeves. Jeez. Ha. <clears throat> oh, it was with Loki. No. 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 No what? There's a Spry. Hi, Loki. And then I see a Tiamat sitting next to Sprite. Hello, Loki. And then I see a Morgan. Hi, Loki. And a Billy. Hi, Loki. And a Tommy. Hey, Loki. And an Eli. What's up, Loki? And a Kate Bishop. Hi, Loki. And America Chavez. Hi, Loki. And a Kamala Khan. Hi, Loki. And a Hulkley. Hey, Loki. And then there's an Axel. Hi, Loki. No. No, no. I also see that firefly. Hi, Loki. And that shark. Hi, Loki. Let's give him a hug. And I do not want hug. <laughs> Aww. Come on, Loki. You have to accept hugs. <laughs> ha. Do not be angry with the Loki. You must accept hugs. Oh, God. Hugs. Okay, folks. We got a fun show today. Well, look. We got some new characters that we could perhaps be. Hey, wait. We got to talk about my movie first. Yep. Yeah, that's what we're doing. Yeah, if you came here expecting us to talk about Rings of Power, you're going to have to find another channel. And if you're going to be rude about it... <laughs> And if you wish to be rude to the toys for not talking about the rings of power, you will be destroyed. <sighs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Star Child, you actually destroyed him? Yep. I am serious about this. <sighs> okay, then, let's get started with this show because. <laughs> We don't have another second to waste. Yeah! Whoo! Okay, everybody! 
Are we ready to celebrate Shang Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings? Yeah! Boo! I don't like that show. <gasps> Name more the Submariner. Yes, Carly. What does that sign say on that wall? One coffee shop, one people. And you are not to boo and say insulting things about other people's movies. Yeah, yeah. Fine, I'm sorry. That's better. Okay, everybody, it's time for Shang Chi to tell his story. Yay! So, uh, tell us your story. Well, let's see. Once upon a time, a man named Wen Wu picked up ten mystical rings. And they was given, he was given immortality and power. He, and he, and he just spread his, his vindic, look, his terrorist syndicate was like all over, us, all over the world. All over the world? Yeah. But the problem is, 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 yeah, well, Hey, you know there's that book called Pride and Prejudice by Jane Austen? Yeah. Oh, yeah. She says it is true that every man who has a good fortune must desire a wife. Yeah. And he, look at this, all this wealth and power and no one to share with. Well, he goes to Talao and meets this woman named Yang Li who guards the gate. And she beats him in open combat. But then they they later on get married and have me and my sister. Oh, uh, okay. So, so all that took place in the, in the late 90s. And so, <sighs> Katie and I are like hotel valets in San Francisco. Like upscale hotel. Like high-end hotels. And they drive those super cool cars. Oh, yeah, super cool cars. <sighs> Katie, why do I have the feeling that everybody here is going to die? Oh, fun. That's not what I meant. Okay, keep going. So, so we enjoy our lives. Well, our, well. Our friends and Kate's parents are like, why are you living like this? Come on. We we are responsible adults. We are living our lives. But then somebody showed up and acts and tries to kill us. <gasps> Don't worry. I find them off. Really? Yeah. <laughs> and then we were recorded. Yep. So I finally told... So I finally told Katie the truth that my dad sent the ten wings to come get me. So, so I sh I had to pack my bags and go meet my sister back in our old hometown. Well, I had to come. Why? Because I had to. Come on, Shang Chi. You know what an adventure is. Yeah, I, I tell her my story after my mom was murdered. Dad taught me how to fight. <laughs> and then... So he set you up as a hitman? Yeah. Where was your bodyguard? Bodyguard? <laughs> <laughs> Boo! Boo! You don't boo during the presentation anymore. Jeez. Yes, what kind of dude are you? Oh, he's just overcompensating for the fact that his last name is McKenzie. Jeez, McKenzie? Isn't that a girl's name? Yep. <sighs> so, I ran off to San Francisco after that hit was made because I couldn't do it. So, I went to San Francisco and Set my setup shop there, and then Katie and I went to Golden Dagger's Club. That's where we met. <laughs> and yes, it was torture to make you take your shirt off. <laughs> that was humiliating. Mm-hmm. 
humiliating for you, but it sure gave the women watching your movie some eye candy. Uh, eye candy? Lots and lots of eye candy. Uh, 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 uh. Hey, buddy, this is a Marvel movie. You gotta remember the law. Yeah, I have to take my shirt off so everyone can see how masculine I look. Oh, this is a stupid rule. The rule may be stupid, but it ain't good for you. But it's going to be enjoyable to the audience. Ugh, I bet you must have liked it too. <laughs> yep. And I didn't even need to use my powers to put my opponents to sleep. No. You totally ducked, and this guy came flying over here and knocked himself out. <laughs> yep. <sighs> and everybody was scared to fight you because you're dangerous. Thank you for acknowledging how dangerous I am. <laughs> and so... Hey, I made him fight on the grand stage just to humiliate him and provide everybody with so much needed memes. What memes? The Mortal Kombat theme song meme and Kung Fu fighting by Carl Douglas. Come on, everybody knows that one. Oh yeah, it's on my classic A. <laughs> Look, it's on my classic <laughs> rock band's playlist. Classic rock playlist. Yep, everybody was Kung Fu fighting. Yeah. No, guys. And so. What happened? Well, I didn't want to fight said that one, but I knocked him out. Why? Hey! <laughs> it was just so worth it to see the look on his face when he realized he was fighting me before I knocked him out. <laughs> That's right, buddy. My side hustle brought in some serious cash. I am swimming in it. Oh, don't you need gold bars? Ugh, so I can jump in the door and bash my head against my pavement? Look, I ain't screwed, my duck. Yeah. And so what happened? Well, if we're a fight, he breaks off. And then I start to sing. On a gold other highway, went blowing in my hair. And then I join in by turning my megaphone up to maximum level and singing so loud that some couple of air drops popped. Oh, jeez. You must be a nightmare karaoke. Oh, please. <sighs> you wouldn't even. They, were, they would have to pay me money not to sing at karaoke. But I do it anyway because I'm so good. Yeah. Well, well, Dad showed up and says, "Come on, guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give y'all a ride home." So he goes, we go home and he explains everything. We go back to headquarters, he explains everything, and and then he uses the pendants that he stole from Shine and his sister. To generate a map, <laughs> it was like all over the floor, and I don't even know. My life just doesn't make sense. Nobody's life doesn't make sense. Yeah. It did. Dad wanted to burn the bell to the ground. <gasps> hey, he can't do that. That's illegal. Yeah. And so. He he sent us to jail, and then along came Trevor Slattery and his pet Morris, who help us take the next path into the forest. Yay! So you leave the compound after after you meet Slattery, and then all of us go to that place, and. And then we go there, the locals confront us, and then my aunt showed up. Oh, huh. so they bought your aunt. So they introduced you to your aunt. No, she came out and introduced herself. And she teaches me how to fight. And she taught me the history of what happened 
in Talao and how soul eaters showed up and almost killed the place. <gasps> okay. I am officially confused. And, and yet I know way too much. And uh, why is everybody now drinking green tea? Oh, you will not believe what happened next. What is it? Well, the dweller in darkness is trying to steal people's souls by mimicking the voice of the loved ones. <gasps> so, so that means that your dad is... So that's how he's going to get your dad. That's how he, he tortured him by using his wife's voice. Yes. <laughs> and so, so my aunt thinks that Dad fell victim to the dwell's influence, or he wouldn't have come here. So, she teaches me how to fight. I get a rope dart. I learned archery. So, yeah, and that too. Hey! Uh, why didn't nobody call me? You're not even in this film, Hawkeye. Yes, right, Hawkeye. Hey, ow, 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 ow. We need to talk. <laughs> Whoa, how long are you going to keep torturing him? Until he tells the truth. Well, well, can we just... Didn't he just tell you the truth like a couple of, of episodes ago? I need him to say it with his own words. Fine. Well, wait. What happened to your mom? She didn't just die. No, the arrogant showed up and hurt her. See, I murdered the gang's leader. Well, you probably... Look, look. He killed your mom. He didn't deserve to live. Come on. It's fair punishment. Yeah. And so... I was playing... So... so my father and all his men showed up. They came to raid the village. And then Dad and I get into a fight. And and at one point I got the rings. Ooh. And then he had releases the soul leaders up there chucking me into the lake. <gasps> Then my teacher death dealer got eaten. So he took So I fight my dad again, take all the rings, but then I decided not to kill him because let's face it, I need my dad. Dad needs his family. That's it, that's all. But then he got a soul taken out. <gasps> <laughs> Jeez! What kind of movie are we watching here? We thought it was going to be an exciting movie. Yeah, with 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 a nominally correct Asian representation. Yeah, and lots of fighting action. And some funny one-liners and family dynamics. Instead, we're going full-on horror movie. No, please. You want full-on horror or try Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness? Yeah, we got zombie strange and evil Doctor Strange and evil Scarlet Witch. Oh no, we don't need any of that in our lives. Hey, do you win? Hey, well, Dad fights. Dad fights. He gets, Dad saves my life. Then he fights well in darkness. Gives me. The ranks, and well, I blow up the dweller in in the battle, and everyone lives. Yay! Everyone's left anyway. Oh yeah! <laughs> and then we won, and not only did we win, well, a lot of people did die. Well, the fight went on for like an hour and a half. Yeah, 
many lives will climb, but eventually. Yeah. So. So Kate and I go home, we tell Sue and John everything, and they don't believe this. Well, all I can say to yeah, you know what? That story is not even true. Oh, they're just making it out. Believe them! It's true. I was there. <laughs> yeah, right. Boy, you got this kid. You're paying her to lie? <gasps> I live streamed that battle on YouTube! YouTube! Ah! Yeah, look at that. You got like over a million hits on YouTube. You went viral. <laughs> yeah! Did anybody not see that? There's just no defense in some people, is there? And so, the, the monk showed up and made us come with him to the Kamartage, and then we talked, yeah, oh yeah. So, you're telling me it took Wong showing up to, to believe him? Come on, nobody ever comes out of walls and circles. Yep. Besides, Wong taught me how to use magic, right? Yep. And then Carol and Bruce tell us uh, that they can't help because... Yeah, what even are those rings? Well, I got this bangle right here. Yeah, where did that bangle come from? My great-grandma. But she's too dead to tell me anything. Oh, yeah, that sucks. Oh, wait. What happened to Xiaoling? I took off for the organization. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> oh, don't worry, toys. I'm not gonna hurt you. Much. Yeah. Okay. 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 Hmm. So, how did everybody react to the movie? People liked it. Of course, people had to like it. Yep. Somebody joined a billion dollar movie club! Yep, the billion dollar movie club. Wait, for Aquaman? Yeah, what about me? Namor! Uh, Namor the Submariner. Sorry, Namor. You can't hang out with us until you got your billion dollar solo movie. Which happens right after your team up movie. Oh, come on! Wait! <laughs> now! Here's the thing. What is it? So, oh, is there any good things? Oh, yeah, we got some good things. You say the ten rings will return. Yep. Once they come back, I'll be back as well. Oh. Auntie. <sighs> Tell us everything. And I mean lots of everything. Huh. Ooh, let's check out the reviews. What do people have to say about it? Where are you? I'm on imdb.com. Yeah. So let's see. All right. What is the... Okay, give us the biggest review rating. Oh, yeah. Some like the movie. Some liked it, some don't. Why did people like it? Yeah, I guess it was great. <sighs> yeah, pretty sucks. Yeah, it sucks for you to lose your dad. But at least you reconciled with him. Yeah. Something I never got a chance to do. Aww. Hey, you can let me out of that. Nuh-uh, -uh, Fang Fang Foom. You're not going anywhere. Oh, come on now. You see what this girl's doing to me? Girl, I am woman. I'm sorry. Excuse me. This woman locked me up in here. Sorry, Fang Fang Foom. You're not going anywhere. Oh, come on. See? You see? You see? This, this woman be locking me up in here. Yep. <sighs> come on now. Everybody seems to like the movie. Yeah. Now, how many movies do we get? Look, it was a good movie. Very good. Very well done. Yay! Well, it's got a 7.4 out of 10 on IMDb. So, that's it. 
That means it did great. Yep. Okay, everybody. What do we have here? Some didn't like Marvel, but you're going to love this. Whoa. So it made a crap ton of money. A crap ton of money. Yeah, it's getting a crap ton of money. We need a... Some people didn't like the movie Marvel, but they do like this. Okay, okay. Rawr. So, let's look at some of these fun things. Whoa. So, there's that. So, Shang-Chi, a year from now, you're now. What do you have to make of this? Well, hey, I came to this little coffee shop place. The toys are very welcoming. Of course the toys were welcoming. Toys, look, toys seem to like you. Of course toys liked me. Right? Okay, but did you know that in the 1980s, Stan Lee wanted to make a movie about Shang-Chi. He had Brandon Lee on call. Whoa, whoa, he wanted Brandon Lee? The son of Bruce Lee. Yeah, unfortunately, one accident on the crow, and uh, that plan fell apart. Ah, oh, yeah. <sighs> so, uh, so that's that? Yeah. Wait, so Stan Lee tried to make a Shang-Chi movie? Yeah. <laughs> what, no Shang-Chi? Yeah. There's more. Yo, oh, wait. Hey, there's one where you were asked to fight in the arena without a shirt on. No, no, no. Why is everybody talking about that? It's humiliating to me. But it's fun for the rest of us. You see, in the comic book move, in your, in the comics, you fought shirtless. <gasps> what? Did you even give me a shirt? They could have just given me a sleepless top. Sorry. <laughs> oh, man. <sighs> Come on. Look, Bruce Lee fought without a shirt on in his movies. What? Yeah. So there's that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But when Wu, according to the movie, just, he just, you know, all, the, all that evil that he's done, he just wanted to be loved. Yeah. <sighs> Come on now. Cosmic jewelry? Yeah. It's a tradition. We had the Infinity Stones and the Infinity Gauntlet. Now we have your rings. They come all as bangle. They're just continuing the tradition. Of course, when we deal with Mandarin in the comics, he wore ten rings on his fingers. All ten fingers? You know, that would that would hurt after a while. Yeah, so that's why he wears them on his arms. Oh. And then they usually had those rings used in training in the martial arts to strengthen the arms. So, there's that. Yeah, and that too. Yeah. Hmm. And what about Morris, the creature that didn't have a face? Hey! Aw, come on guys. He's adorable, see? Aww. Come on. Don't you want to pet him? No, 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 we good, we good. Oh, come on. Yeah, they thought Kevin Feige was going to shot down that idea. But Feige said, sure, why not? He did a sure, why not? Oh, oh well. So, there was a Kung Fu hustle? Yep. Yeah. Oh. Oh, is there more? 
Is that just a village? No. It ain't just a village. It's a whole freaking region. Wow. Does it have cities? Yep. Huh. I guess I know where I'm going on my next vacation. Yep. So, you... Nah, I'll probably go next summer. Besides, I'm going to be going to Wakanda soon. Yeah. <sighs> really? So, is there more? So, the Golden Daggers Club, yeah, it was a criminal organization led by, oh, my sister. Yep. I had a different name. But I wanted to take on my father, so I built a rival empire. <gasps> oh, come on now. Toys, let's be friends. No, what did they do? They took a lot of cues from Crouch, Attacker, Hidden Dragon, Kung Fu Hustle, Tai Chi Master, The Matrix, Ip Man, and Jackie Chan's movies. Oh. Wait a minute. <sighs> they even, yeah, a lot of visual scenes came from Dragon Ball. <laughs> Come on, Dragon Ball is still so freaking popular today. Now, I don't know, Dragon Ball is just a walking mean thing by now. Yep. What about Ant Man? Yeah, they really should have put Ant Man in a movie. <sighs> No, 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 no. No what? No shang Chi's. No ant Man's. None of that. <sighs> oh, look, the bus fight scene came from Chucky Chan and Buster Keaton. What? Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's interesting. 25th film in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Whoa. Yep. We're only a quarter away there. Yeah, they give us Hotel California. Yeah. We're going to Hotel California. Yeah, they didn't even, they didn't even let your film be in China. Why is everyone looking silently at... That's him. Who, that ugly dude? On second. Boom! Hey, buddy. Not call the chair when everyone says boo! <sighs> How long do you have to keep being rude to those poor, sweet, innocent little toys? Jeez. Yeah, what did the toys ever do to you? Aww. So, wait a minute. <sighs> so, what did we get? Wait a second. We have the comics, remember? Oh, yeah. Your dad was Fu Manchu, who was so stereotypical that they said, mm-mm, unacceptable. We're going to make him the Mandarin. Oh, yeah. But he was still leader of the Ten of Rings since Iron Man Part 3. Yep. I oh, know. Comics are weird. Yeah. Comics are weird. Yep. Oh, what are comics have to be weird? Hmm. Wait a minute. They try to get Shang-Chi and the Mandarin in the Avengers. <sighs> what? And they said no. They didn't want a Chinese villain. Oh, come on. They would have set up the story a whole lot better. Much better. Yep. Ha. Yeah. And uh, so what do we have? What's next? Ooh. Wait a second. 
second. Oh, he said Mandarin. I don't want trouble. <laughs> Where did that come from? That came from Rush Hour by Jackie Chan. Jeez, <laughs> they're really pulling all the stops. Yep. Well, Disney bought Marvel, but Paramount Pictures was supposed to make it. Yeah, I know. Wow. We even did a whole new world. <laughs> Wait. Wait, hold on. The woman playing me will play Scuttle in The Little Mermaid? Yep. Why? Because it's going to be funny. That's why. Ugh. <sighs> yep. So what do we have? Oh, yeah. We have all these movies. Yeah, there's somebody had been in a Christopher Lee movie in the 1960s. Christopher Lee? Yeah. The legendary Christopher Lee. Responsible for all those horror movies that kept you up at night. Eep! Shot under the work town Steamboat. What Steamboat? Yeah. Hmm. Ah. Uh. So, you did, well, in my room, it was an ACDC poster. Why? Hey, I like ACDC. Yeah, yeah, you want to know who else is a fan of ACDC? Hmm. Tony Stark. Yep. Da, 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 Stan Lee tried to get Brandon Lee to be in Shang-Chi. Oh. So, so great. So, no Stan Lee. Nope, no Stan Lee. Aw, man, that sucks. Of course that sucks. Huh. Okay, so let's keep looking. Fun facts. Yeah. They do a whole new world. Yep. They stole that from Disney. Yep. A whole new world. They did. We also sang Old Town Road. Of course, Lil Nas X had to survive the blip or he wouldn't have given us that song. We're gonna take this horse to the Old Town Road. Oh. So look at that. Oh, he's not Professor Hulk? No, he had an inhibitor chip on him so he can heal. Oh, yeah. And then we had Emil Blonsky. Yeah, well... <sighs> Wong is a dirty cheater. Hey, come on now. Don't be a sore loser. Aw. Ha. <sighs> Is there more? Yeah, we had Ben Kingsley as Trevor Slattery. He was in Iron Man Part 3 as Fake Mandarin and All Hail the King. Oh, so what happened after that? He got taken prisoner. Hey guys, I'm here. Hi, Trevor. Oh, come on now. What? Yeah. Uh, we thought about a dragon. Yeah. The dragons are the good guys. Yeah. Of course, the Mandarin is Tony Stark's enemy. Yeah, but he's always beating him. <laughs> yeah. You're right. Mm. But Fu Manchu was a real jerk. Ooh, we hate that guy. But then they renamed him Zhen Zhu. And he's still a jerk. Yeah. There shit. I mean... We had the Eternals and the Deviants and Celestials. Yep. Hmm. Yeah. And uh, there's more. Wait. And then Aquafina was Sisu and Raya and the Last Dragon. Oh. And Daddy Rand dealt with Shalal the Undying. Yep. 
He protects a trans-dimensional realm called Kung, Kung Lung. When are you going to be in there? Uh, I don't know. Wait. Now let's talk some rumors about when are you going to come into the show? Well, it says 2025. It's going to be a while. But we don't care. We need more. Yeah. That's right. Leave them wanting more. In 2025, we could get a new Shang-Chi. Hooray! And now you have to use the Ten Rings. Yep. But now, wait, the Secret Invasion trailer says it's scroll versus scroll. <gasps> wow, brother versus brother and everybody suffers. Yep. And then there's also the Ten Rings and the Bangle that's the new Infinity Stones. But we still have Kane the Conqueror to deal with. <laughs> oh, hello everyone. And toys. How are you all doing? Hey, you're not supposed to be in here. I'm just here to tell you all that Ataman and the Wasp Quantuminium is coming faster than you think. <laughs> Seriously? Let's put this guy. <gasps> See you soon. Okay, I continue to like him less and less the more we see him. You keep saying that. Yeah, that guy's weird. Yeah. Look, there's going to be more Shang-Chi. Yeah. I mean... Wait, do doesn't that mean you can't just... Look, it's not me. Look, I can jump into other movies. You know? Yeah. There's gotta... Well, they gotta make up a reason for you to be in those movies. The next few years will give you more movies. Yeah. Like... You could deal with... Iron Fist. You could deal with Eternals. You can deal with... Ant-Man. Yeah. But hey... <sighs> I can help fight Kane the Conqueror. Yep. And that too. Ha! Oh my, who on earth is that? Uh, that's a star child. He's pretty sarcastic. Yeah. Well, wait, hold on. Uh, hold up. They say that your rings are extraterrestrial. Yep, so is my bango. I mean, my great grandma was an was an extraterrestrial, but then she married your great grandpa and had your grandma. Yep. So, wait one second. Ah, <sighs> oh, what was that spam? I wish they would quit spamming us. Yeah, Bob and somebody calling you up asking you for your reviews on Rings of Power. Rude! Right in the middle of us talking. Okay, okay, okay. We need... Well, actually... Uh, my great-grandma came from a clandestine. Oh... Uh, wait a second! <gasps> Was Wenwu there? As well? Yep. Or if it's Cree? Wait a minute. Are you a Cree? Uh, I don't know. <sighs> Wait, the rings are far or older than your dad knew. Yep. So what's happening next? We don't know. So, uh... So there's that. Wait, wait, wait. One more thing. One more thing. One more thing. One more thing. Mm. You're telling me that... Well, why is everybody talking about Marvel Combat? Marvel Combat? It's hilarious. Yeah... But then again, hey, 
I'm pretty sure that... Wait, sure that what? <gasps> Wait! We all know you're going to get a sequel. Yes, it is going to be a sequel. And... Look, you get a 4.6 out of 5. So people seem to like it. Yeah. But there's one more thing. What is it? What should happen in the sequel? Well, I am going to be powerful and have my 10 rings, but maybe I could just jump into some other movies and TV shows just to sink my teeth into it. Yeah! Okay, uh, do us a favor, dude, and uh, sit, sit tight, because we got to get into She-Hulk. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, come on, let's, let's hear about She-Hulk, yeah! Okay, folks, we're going to take a short break, and then we get back, we're dealing with She-Hulk! Okay, everybody, presenting the She-Hulk finale! Hey, hold up, hold up, wait a minute! Excuse me, what are you doing here? Oh, uh, I'm here to nothing. Ah, no! Get out of here! Ah! Uh-uh. You are not taking over this show. Um, uh, and Jen, this is our show. Yep. And somebody's trying to take over your show. Very rude. Like, very, 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 very rude. Ha! Okay. Now, I'm gonna break all the rules. You always break the rules. Oh, hello. I'm Deadpool. I like to break all the rules. Ah! Out, Deadpool! Out, 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 out! You don't even belong here! Ow, out! <sighs> Deadpool! Get straight out! Ha! Okay. So now we were thinking, was it a good idea to end? Oh, no, no, no. Let me tell you how the story begins. And last leaves off in me. I'm in jail. Aww. And, well, unfortunately, I'm not allowed to be <laughs> She-Hulk anymore. Oh, yeah, that sucks. Yeah, you're right. It sucks. But that's okay. Because, guess what? What? Oh, I lost my apartment, lost my job, had to move back with my family. Ugh. I had to get out of there, so I went back to Blonsky's place. Yeah, yeah, we're glad to have you back. Yeah, glad you're back, Jen. And, well, I had one more clue that landed me in the door. Ooh, what is it? A video about you dancing. Yeah, but look at that. We thought and told Jesse of the super villains. Now, yeah, now just a bunch of sad boys who, like, ooh, the Mighty Thor story sucks. Really? The Mighty Thor story is Jane has cancer. And she doesn't want to have cancer. But when she picked up meal near the cancer went away. And so did the chemotherapy. Oh, yeah. Well. Look at this. We've seen a lot of bad things happening. Yeah. A lot of people. How do. Are you really watching the show? Yeah, the show's a commentary on the state of life. Okay, you won't believe what happened. Hey, what happened? We all crashed the meeting and everybody's fighting. I fight. I face up to Todd, who turns out to be hulking. And he puts Hulk serum on him and turns to the Hulk. Yeah, I'm the Hulk! Eh, shut up, you stupid troll! You will not interrupt me, Loki! Blah. Yeah! Hey, hey, what's up, Titaniacs? We're about to see some live action fun! Involving... Ugh, Jen! And those adorable little toys. Hey! I'm gonna wrap you to shreds. Woo! Not today, buddy. 
Oh no, you are not going to tear her apart. Not on my watch. Hey, step away from my cousin. Oh, come on, Bruce. I'm trying to protect her. Hey, guys, stop, 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 stop. Okay. Here, Jen, what? Use this remote from click. Because remote from control from click? Yeah. Oh, hit the pause button. Click. Phew. Well, that's interesting. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's interesting. You just hit the pause button. Yeah, everyone's getting ready to fight. Ugh. Hello, one coffee shop, one people. I don't like fighting. I'm like, look, none of this makes any sense. None of it. You're right. Huh. I decided a Hulk smash the fourth wall. Wait, you're Hulk smashing fourth wall? Whoa, what are you doing? A uh, dude, that's the YouTube channel. You can't just break through there. Yes, I can. Oh, wait. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Excuse me, ma'am. You can't come in here and move. <sighs> okay, so let's do this. All right. Uh, we have to have a surprise. The kid that slowly goes and hangs out with them. But one by one, something awful happens to them. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on here? Oh, Tara, Karen, Humphrey, what are you guys doing here? Oh, uh, yeah, we didn't mean to crash your writing session, Susie, but... Uh, wait, hold on. Let me see what you guys are writing. The Kenner Project? Whoa, wait, hold up. Yeah, it's like a play on the Blair Witch Project, but it deals with some Lola's Pet Shop lore. Oh, that's interesting. Wait, you're making a shy kid the bad guy? Come on, Jen. The shy kid's the bad guy. You never know. The bully isn't always the bad guy. It's always the shy kid. Oh, yeah. Whoa, so why are you having them go around and take down all of them? Well, yeah, you're right. According to this whole thing, it doesn't make sense. The kids that made fun of them aren't even in the group. Well, wouldn't it make sense to have them all in the group? Mm. Or maybe just have them making fun of them, but they don't know that they're making fun of them. I mean, no. Actually, let me say this. The kid thinks they're making fun of them, but they're not. It's just a mistaken identity. Yeah, but by the time he finds out, it'll be too late. Wow, you're really giving us some good ideas. Yep. I mean, look, this is so amazing just to watch this story unfold. Yep, but then I met Kevin. Kevin Feige? Nope. He stands for Knowledge Enhanced Visual Interconnectivity Nexus. Oh. So that's the one who's responsible for what we see in Marvel. Yep. So, when did we get X-Men? He didn't say. Boo! Hooray! Oh, oh hey, Jen. Here you go. And then Namor the Submariner was sent away to his kingdom to await the day he would get his butt whooped by the Iron Butterfly in Black Panther Wakanda Forever. What? Ah! Ah! He'll be back within a month. Yep. Wait. Why does he... Why does Kevin wear Kevin Feige's baseball cap? Yeah. Look at this. Ugh, I know. What's with the dad issues? My dad was murdered when I was a kid. Yeah, that's, wow, that's the ultimate dad issue. Yeah, look at this. Everybody has issues with dads. That's unhealthy. What are the mom issues? Yeah. No, look, there's a, too much dad issues? No romance? Where's the romance? The Eddie's always repeat themselves? Well, Jen, Man of Steel scenario. Evenly matched heroes by evenly matched bad guys. You're right. Well, <laughs> and uh, do you and Daredevil ever team up? Yeah, yeah, we need that. We need that. We need that. And Titania, 
What's her purpose? To be annoying. Ha <laughs> ha. Sorry, Titania. Nope. I just wrote the part where you get magically locked up in a cage. <laughs> Sorry, Titania. You've been annoying. Yeah, annoying, Titania. Ah, boo. Yep, that too. And not only that. Well, let's see. Well, but well, we'll have it at the end. Oh wait, hold on. Let's hit the fast move button. Swing. Excuse me, Miss Walters. Oh, officer? Yes, this guy been harassing you. Yep. Hey, you can't do this to me. Yes, I can, and I will, and I just did. Yep. And not only that, I was live streaming this, and all your little buddies are going to jail. Hey, that was so mean. Oh, great. Yep. Caught life, caught by a butterfly, and it stings like a bee. Oh, yep, humiliation. Yeah, well, I did turn to abomination, but that was to protect Jen from this really stupid moment. Yep. Well, we finally found out the ugly truth. Look, I learned to balance both sides of my identity. That's why my life fell apart. But don't worry, we're gonna take this, and we're gonna take both sides of your life. And some super glue, and we're going to super glue it back together. Ew. There we go. There. Ah, thanks. Yeah. And that's what we got. Ah, well, everything looks all right. Oh, yeah. Back in its own place. Yep. Not a piece out of place. Yeah, but what about season two of She Hulk? Oh, no. Yes, no. Oh yeah, I just got a neat I just got a text message from Kevin Feige. Kevin Feige? Not the Kevin that we spoke to? No. Prepare for the next part of your story. Because you will be needed. Yeah, but then there's one more thing we need to talk about. Well, at least I got my story back. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. How does the story end? Yeah. Look at this. We found out who the bad guys are. Who's leading the group. Abomination. And all that at the retreat. Yep. My retreat. My rules. I don't allow stuff like that to happen. See, look. I made my retreat for a reason. Ugh, had I known about this, I would have destroyed them. But you can't be Abomination. Hey, I didn't need to turn to Abomination to crush them. All right. And then, of course, the fourth wall broke. Look at this. Fan theories are destroyed, and it makes sense. Yeah. A lot of that made a sense. Yeah. Okay, we didn't need Red Hulk or the leader. Sam will be dealing with the leader, so we didn't need to see him yet. Yeah. And then I see you now. Um, and we forgot, look, you didn't check, you, you didn't check your expectations at the door. Yeah, it's a legal comedy. He's a real jerk. They didn't use, of course, I poke fun at MCU. Yeah. Come on, why do we have all these dad issues? No romance, no nothing. Come on, where's the real stuff? Yeah. Yeah. I even spoke to the people writing my show. Oh, yeah. Ha. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Ha. And, look, it's Kevin, who's actually Kevin Feige in disguise. I finally got a chance to take back my story. Yeah! All right, Jen, finally got to take back your day! Yay! Wait, Bruce? Hey, good job, Jen, you took back your story. Hey, Bruce, what are you doing here? Hey, get back, guys. You went gone. 
for like seven episodes. Yeah, we missed you. Yep, I had to come back. But there was something I needed to do on Sakaar. And I needed seven episodes to do that. <clears throat> like, oh, everybody need to say hi to my son, Scar. Hi, Scar! Sub toys. <laughs> Whoa! Wow, 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 wait a minute, hold up, hold up. Just when do you have a son? Well, yeah, let's just say it's between Captain America Civil War and uh, Thor Ragnarok. Oh. Wait, does this mean we're still getting Planet Hulk? Yep, it's happening, y'all, it's happening. <gasps> oh, wait, let's get it as a movie. Yep. A very big movie. So. Yeah, maybe next year we could get that as a movie. That would be so awesome. Yeah. Wait. But don't you and Daredevil get together? Hmm. I'm going to leave that one up in the air. Gary, let's put some foundations on it there. Well, he's going to be an echo in Daredevil born again. Yep. I gotta get ready for those shows. Ugh. I gotta deal with Kingpin again. I like to punch that guy in the face. Hello, everybody. It's King again. Oh, who the heck are you? I'm Kingpin. And Pa! Hey, man. Rude. You don't talk to the toys like that. Oh. I was just trying to be nice to the toys. Ha <laughs> ha, you can't be nice to the toys. You suck. So you, Homelander. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I know what you be doing, Kingpin. I know exactly what you be doing. No! Homelander, stop! Wait. It's not like we can't see Matt and Jen together. Yay! Wait! There's one more thing. What's with the post credit scene? Yeah. I was about to stay in jail for 10 years even though I signed that deal. Yep. So that's why I came over and picked him up. Yeah. So. I could do. Wait. Doesn't this mean you can get yours off your jail sentence if you work for the Thunderbolts? Oh, yeah. Ugh, I didn't think about that. You gotta think about that. Come on, work off years of your jail sentence by doing community service. Yep. Like, I have to start teeing cookies to the toys and work at this cat's tea shop. Yep. And that too. <laughs> That's right, Carla, you're working at my place as community service. As a Sprite and John Walker. What about good Thanos? Yeah, I'm the bouncer. I keep people out of the bar. Like you, Kingpin. Hey, you can't kick me out. Time to give you the old bum rush. Ah! Yep, Kingpin looking really sus, y'all. Yeah, that guy's sus. Shouldn't be among us. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Before we go any further, will we have a She-Hulk part two? Hmm. We don't know. Well, some of the other Disney Plus shows felt like one movie stretched out over six episodes. Yeah, but you got nine episodes, like WandaVision. Oh. But to my show, it gets a second season. So there. Bleh. Ha. Yeah, and that too. Wait a minute. That doesn't mean... We can't have a part two. Yeah. Wait. They just threw in. Wait. There's a werewolf by night. Wait. Morbius. Oh, look. It's Morbius. Who's Morbius? Ah. A vampire. Who's a vampire? Yeah. Uh. My name is Morbius. I dealt with. Werewolf by Night, who's Jack Russell? Please, whatever you do, do not laugh, okay? His name 
is Jack Russell because hey, that, that's just how it is. Yeah, comics are weird. Yeah, but they're there too. Yeah. Way! She Hulk can be. Yeah, I can replace him on the Avengers. Yeah, but. We need somebody else. Wait. We need. To give. Wait. You gotta have you meet. We have to get you, Bruce, to meet Jack. Yeah. So, uh. Well, actually. Hi, Jack. Yeah, I'm Jack Russell. And I have this werewolf that lives inside me. He wants to be. He wants to, like, tear people apart, you know? Yeah, I understand what you mean. I got a green monster that lives inside me that wanted to tear people apart. But I created Smart Hulk. I, I mean, I took two. I took two halves of me and just combined them into one. Yep. Ha. So. Wait. Who do you hang out with? Well, I hang out with Man Thing. And there's Elsa Bloodstone. Wait. But doesn't she sing that song that Black Widow used to sing the Hulk? Yeah. You know. Well, we got... We have what's called... Wait, hold on. <sighs> My phone be blowing up. Yeah, a lot of people are starting to like your shows. Oh, not just that. But look, you're Werewolf by Night. Yeah. You could be part of the Thunderbolts. Or I can be on the Midnight Suns. Oh. I have, like, eternal conflict. So... You should, like, be yourself. So, you gotta control your powers. Yeah, but, but, I mean, it's one, hey, it's one good thing you gotta have to worry about. And these are toys. I mean, they're nice. Except for that stupid sea man who needs to get punched in the face. Ugh, they mortal up, man. What's wrong with him? Oh, don't worry. He got kicked out. He ain't coming back anytime soon. Yeah, wait! Mm -hmm. Now, let's follow the clues to uh see if we can have a She-Hulk movie. Well, let's see. It is not just other shows. It's my career. And look at this. You got to do courtroom drama and superhero stuff. Yep. And now that I got control of my story, that's what we got to do. What you need to do? We might have, we might have Daredevil, Abomination, the Smart Hulk, and the Wrecking Crew. We came in like the Wrecking Crew. <laughs> you guys are so dumb as heck. Ah, uh -huh, you're still in a cage, and that butterfly girl. Will not let you out. Yeah, I'm mad at her. Why can't you let me out? Sorry, Titania. You're not going anywhere. Yeah, you suck, Titania. Boo! I'm beyond you, Titania. Ah, you do not show my friends any respect. And our guest, though. Ah! Ah, cat. Ah, you're even worse than that other Persian cat. Other Persian cat? What on a Persian cat? There's only one Persian cat here. And that's beyond a master than you, you ex you cheap excuse for a diva. <laughs> Can't even hit anybody without them putting you to sleep. <laughs> you suck, Titania. Totally. I'm pretty sure Kevin Feige will throw out a season two just to see if everybody's going to whine and complain about it and inevitably watch it and like it because, hey. Well, okay. Now they got a million unannounced projects in 2024 and 2025. So you can jump in there if you feel like it. Yep. Or, well, I could be in Daredevil Reborn. Yep. And 
Wait, you can even jump into a Hulk project. Yep. Yep. Hey, so, uh, well, is this Loki? No. 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 What? Wait, uh, Dad, why does that guy say no? Uh, Loki? No. No, you don't creep a hammock. You will not tell your son to give me a hug. Oh, what? What's his issue? Eh, uh, Loki's got issues. The best way to solve those issues is to give him a hug. No, 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 no. Oh, come on, Loki. You need a hug. Come on, Loki. Give hugs. Yes, Loki. Give hugs or I smash. <laughs> okay, you stupid hug. Come on. Yeah, come on, give me a hug, man. Come on, come on, come on, give a hug. <laughs> Thor never gives me hugs. Well, hey. I know, if Thor hugged you more and made fun of you less, you would have been a better person. Yeah. Ha. <sighs> Unfortunately. Hmm, Loki is still not happy with how his show ended. Yes, and that stupid he who remains sent me to another world where toys were still eating toys. Yeah, like, all that good stuff. Yeah, I'm just glad you dealt with it. Mm-hmm. So, wait. I'd, wait. I got my happy ending, but that don't mean Kevin ain't going to continue with his story. I'm pretty sure Kevin does not like to be trapped with. Yeah. I already know I'm going to be paying for that. You always will. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, he broke me out of jail so I could stay with him, Carmitage. Come on now. Community service. Hey, uh, can I hang out here with you guys? Well. Hey, as long as you know how to make anything but pumpkin spice, you're cool. Wait, wait, hold up, hold up. Who keeps ordering pumpkin spice? Those losers over there. Oh, yeah, look at those guys over there and over there and all of Homelander's superhero buddies. Hello, hello, hi, hey, what's up? Yeah, come on now. Hmm? Pumpkin Spice? No. If I have to tell you guys I don't want Pumpkin Spice... Nope. But you can have the Cough Drop Special. Uh, not the Cough Drop Special! Hey! Uh, there's something wrong with my stomach. Oops! I put laxatives in there and locked up the bathrooms! Carly! Oh, hey! Open the door! Hey, give us the door! Oops! I gave the key to Sprite! And she's gotta get in with the... If she drinks coconut water! Oops! Hey! Give it back! Uh-uh! She drinks coconut water and doesn't share! Nee, 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 nee. Ha. <laughs> oh! God, that's it! Let's go to the bathroom! <laughs> yeah, in the next restaurant! Okay, uh, we'll see you next week, Snarky Cat. And Snarky Sousy, Homelander. Snarky Sousy! Ah! <sighs> I hate that stupid Homelander. Meow! Yeah, Homelander sucks. Whew! Whoa, Carly, how'd you do that? Um, actually, don't nobody go in there for an hour, okay? I just. <sighs> Ooh, that pumpkin spice did not agree with my intestines. Ooh, yep, that's why I don't make pumpkin spice anything. And you didn't even let me, you had it out of my reach. Ah, sorry, Sprite, but you can't drink coconut water and not share. Ah, Sprite, do not become angry with Carly because she is only telling the truth. Oh, come on! 
Yep. Wait. Wait, hold up. If abomination is in Karmataj, that means you're not going to be in Thunderbolts. Oh, yeah. So. Now we know why. Well, yeah. Well, after I was released from jail the first time, I got inner peace. I dumped my military service and my powers to help people like Mambo and Porcupine. Hello! Hello! Hi! And I make money from my public appearances. You just making money? Yep, and I put that back in my retreat. Yeah! Ooh, I'm feeling pretty good about this. Yeah! Whoa, at least Oh, they sell the toys are nice. Yeah, nice toys. Well, it's got a better ending. Yeah, I'm glad you went off with Wong instead of being forced into service with the Thunderbolts. Yeah, you can work on yourself, attain inner peace, and you will never have to worry about Valentina Allegra de Fontaine ever again. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, I wouldn't be too sure, toys. And you, little butterfly, ah, I already saw your offer and I'm not going for it. Nope. Oh, come on now. I'm an Avenger, not a Thunderbolt. And besides, I hate the little boat Ross's guts. <sighs> Ooh, okay. <sighs> yeah, you know, you might want to save yourself the trouble and not hire her, okay? She'll tear you apart. <laughs> and proud of it too. Yeah, and she's a savage. Yeah, I'm a savage, you're right. I'm classy, I'm sassy, I'm bougie. She's naughty and flirty and moody. You mess with me, I will kick your booty. Because I'm a savage. Whoa, okay, I don't think I want anyone that savage in my group. Ugh. Well, guess what? And uh, plus, I did train with the masters of the mixed stick art, so... Well, at least that's a good thing you do. You can keep me safe. <laughs> yep. Oh, don't worry. What about Dr. Strange Part 3? Oh, uh, we still are dealing with that. Yep. It'll be a while for you. It'll be a while before you can come out. Yeah. You could be in Captain America New World Order. Yeah. And then, I could finally go back and beat up Sam Stearns. Yeah. And, and not only that. Oh yeah, you can come back in Captain America Part 4. Yeah. And that doesn't mean, wait, wait, who's Scar? Yeah, hold up, who's Scar? Who's Scar? Mmm, yeah. One more thing. What? What is it? Uh, wait, it's one more thing. Who is Scar? Uh, hi, toys. How are you? And, and this guy here needs help. No, 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 I don't need help. Look, Loki. You are unhappy. Ah! Oh, now there's someone I need to talk to. <laughs> I mean, your friends are toys. And you seem to love your brother, but your brother initially treated you like a piece of garbage. <laughs> I mean, he sat there and did nothing while your neck was choked to death by that evil Thanos. Hey, not me. I'm the good Thanos. Oh, uh, yeah, that's the good Thanos. Oh. So, we get the... Yeah, you were off-world. Yeah, I've been living there since Age of Ultron. So, you actually created a son. Yeah. So, Scar, tell us your story. Oh, yeah. Uh, I was featured in the comics in 2006. My parents are Bruce... Egg Kyra. 
and my mom is very powerful. She can manipulate lava and stone. So, wait a minute. You have all those? Yeah, but that is. Are they setting up, um, Planet Hulk? Yeah, a World War Hulk. <gasps> Well, they might go that way. You'll never know, toys. I mean, Mom worked for the Red King who rode over the car. The Red King forces him to fight. Ooh. Who, the Hulk? Yeah. But then, one civil war and overthrowing later. Ah. <sighs> uh, the Red King and 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 uh, Dad fight, and then Dad beats him, marries Mom, and creates me. Ah, oh. and then Mom died because of explosion, and then Dad got went to Earth, and and he's like super mad because hey, an explosion. That kills his wife would make any Hulk go mad. And you fought, you fought a lot of people. Yeah, I fought Axeman Bone. Skakar got eaten by Galactus. I was, I wanted to kill my dad because he ruined everything, and yet he and I learned to bond. So, does that mean you get to join another part of the Avengers? Hey, if the occasion calls for it, I will be an Avenger someday. Hooray! Yeah. Huh. Yep. So, wait. Since when did Hulk have a son? Hmm. Okay, so, uh, really? So, uh, wait, wait, hold up, hold up. Since when were you born? Well, maybe at the tail end of Thor Ragnarok. Yeah. Of course, though, they didn't need to put in the Red King when you have Grandmaster, played by Jeff Goldblum. Yeah, Grandmaster was crazy. Of course it was crazy. Where was Kyra? And all your other girlfriends. Oh, hey. Look, I know, I know you wanted to do all that, but we had to move the story along. Oh. It was my last few days, though. Hmm. So, what happened during your last few days? Well, thing is, I did escape from the... From the gladiator arena with Thor, and not only that. Wait a minute. Actually, we can assume that you escaped, and you had a secret. And what if you did have a wife? Yeah. Wait. What's gonna happen to to Scar in the MCU? Well, yeah. Yeah. Uh, the next time you might come back will be. In 2023. Yeah. I mean, it was a bad joke. Yeah, it won't be a bad joke when we see you for realsies. Yeah. But I, I mean, it's not like I can't show up here. And if not, you can always hang out with us. Toys. Yeah. Wait. We gotta hear the story about what happened when Bruce went back to the car. Well, I'm afraid that's for another story, guys. And possibly uh, 2023. So y'all, y'all just gonna have to wait a few more months. Oh, okay. <laughs> and that too. Wait. Mm -hmm. Who's the real bad guy? Cause it ain't Hulk King or Titania, as awful as they are. <sighs> it was Kevin. <gasps> Not Kevin Foggy. No, the robot Kevin. Yeah. She just made fun of Marvel. Yep, I did. Hey. You, 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 in a lot of problems. Yeah. 
Do you think it's so oversaturated? It was so boring and not very exciting. Ugh. You still a super soldier serum line? Please change it. Like, instead of big fights, let's have some of the people whose stories are being told. Yeah. It's not just fanfare. It's the story. At least it's better. Well, that story, everybody thinks the story about you facing Kevin Slime. But it's better than the alternative. Yeah. Come on, an evil Hulk. Come on, please. I could have slapped that evil Hulk back to next week. Ooh. You could have slapped him back to last week. <laughs> Red Hulk, yawn. I mean, I probably should have could have slapped Titania like super hard. I mean, but you didn't even need to smack her to knock her down. After all, she did break her veneers when you tried to when she tried to fight you at that wedding, she broke her veneers. Ugh. Yep. I did see look at this. She didn't like the vans. Ugh, I feel betrayed. But that's okay. It was the studios. Yep, I finally got what I wanted. And give us better stories. Or, yeah. Who knows? Yeah, who knows how this story is going to go. Besides, we're still going to focus on Black Panther Wakanda forever. But that, my friends, is for another story. <laughs> okay, everybody. <laughs> It's time for us to wrap this thing on up. So, thank you very much for tuning in to this podcast. We're glad you enjoyed it. Yeah, no matter how many Kevin She-Hulks talk to, the story is still the story. Yep, why should that not surprise me? I mean, you toys seem to know what you're doing. We do. <laughs> and remember, if you like this show, Make sure you put a like on the video and put in a comment. Subscribe to the channel so you'll get more. All right, everybody. Show's over. So time to go home. Bye. Ugh. And if anybody chooses not to watch my show when it happens again, oh, you will be filled with pain, pain, pain. Oh, Loki. Oh, oh yeah. This is some karaoke. 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 Let's do this. That's right. I'm that butterfly. I'm the superhero you've all been waiting for. But you're not in the Marvel Cinematic Universe yet. That doesn't mean I can't jump in any time. Hit it. One, two, three, four. I've been there since the beginning. Yeah. I'm always come out winning. Yeah. I never, ever, ever lose. But when they do, I make sure whoever beats me gets confused. I'm not the type of woman that you could put down, leave on the side of the road, and think that it's all right. Mm -mm, I don't believe that. I come after you. God slang it. That's right. I sure. Bunches are blazing. That's right, y'all. Look at you. <laughs> yeah. You made fun of me. You call me bad names, but guess what? I'm popular learn now. I done got a makeover. She's popular. She spreads rumors about you. And that's right. I stole your man. Ha! What do you think of that? Oh, how can you be like that? This. Mm, 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 mm. I'm a savage. Mm. I'm classy and sassy and bougie. I'm nerdy and flirty and booty. You mess with me. I will kick your booty. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was seven. Mm. She's sassy and classy and bougie. She's naughty and flirty and moody. You mess with her. She will kick your booty. Uh-huh. That's right. She's a savage. Meow.